So in the, in the output here, you have uh, show hyperbola on. Okay. All right. And then we start collecting data. You can see the hyperbola there. Start collecting data. And then we roll it. So now we're looking at the rebar. Okay, you can see the hyperbola for me. So let's map that rebar as so we go back until we over that rebar there. And we use this to horizontal cursor just to get exactly onto that peak. There we go. And then we go to dielectric here. Press dielectric. And we change the shape of that curve to match that rebar there. So I'm just turning it until we get the shape to It's a bit difficult with this. It's a bit small here. There we go. That's, that's probably about right. And if we're happy with it, then we say OK. And it's now set our dielectric is 9.7 and it's adjusted our depth scale on the side here. So 9.7 here for concrete is about right. Should be between about 5 and about 12. So, so there we go. So it's actually that Okay, that easy. you shouldn't have to do it more than once if your medium isn't so changing. So you, you would just do it in, in, a, in a general area. So let's say if you're on the water while the library lawns, uh, you would do it once okay. for the lawns. But if you went down to below the swimming pool or up to the top there, you might want to do it again. Okay. Yeah, so. And this is the hyperbola eccentricity yeah, so to determine yeah. the depths. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And you can actually then migrate it as well. If you press focus, focus is off at the moment. Mm -hmm. If you press focus on, it's migrated it now. Okay. Then you just need to add some gain because you've taken energy out of the data. So, so this will be this is supposed to be the migrated section. Okay. And if we so move, this would be your final. Yeah, if we move off of here, you can actually see it's collapsed the hyperbola on the rebar to, to a, a black and a white spot. Okay. And this is the data you would usually show the client, this final migrated yeah, or it depends. a bit of both? So if you're doing geotechnical stuff, I'd do migrated data because it also does dip move out. Okay. So when you're going down a, a hill. Um, but if I'm going to show customers sort of like this, but if you, I prefer the hyperbola because you can actually show them, look, that is, that is exactly there. Exactly. Because I mean, that's not that and that look a bit similar. And that's just an interference where you have two tails of two hyperbolas oh, overlapping okay. so it's, it's okay. easier to interpret with the focus off okay so i've got to get the gain down again but okay. you can see that's actually easier to interpret as a rebar than yes. the other way around there you can see there's actually nothing down there yes okay that's it cool